Hello YouTube family, Greg D here with TGN and we are back for another DCUO video and today we are going to open up some of these unlocked Resurgence Mega Capsules to see if these things are actually worth it. I don't think honestly that I've ever, in the entire time that I've played DCUO, I don't think I've ever really focused on these Mega Capsules and I don't think that I've ever opened any of them, at least not that I can remember. Um, I've been playing the game since day one, and I don't honestly remember opening up these at all, ever. Um, just because they take seven stabilizers to open up one. Uh, so that is a that is a lot of um, time, especially when these only last for 14 days. So I figured that we would open up a few unlocked ones, uh, just to see if they're actually worth it. And then you can kind of judge for yourself. You know how I like to be uh, the guinea pig. Uh, for you guys so you can kind of judge for yourself whether this is something that you would want to um, actually work towards or you know spend the money to um, unlock these yourself or you know whatever the case is but uh, as you see there you do get each one of them uh, gets a mercy and flame reward box unlock kryptonian capsule cursed gotham time capsule atlantean shazam dark knights dark multiverse oracle flashpoint and teen titans uh, so, and I know that also I will probably have a bunch of people saying, oh, you should have gotten this, you shouldn't have gotten this, you should have gone for this collection, you should have gone for this emblem, da 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 yada 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 blah blah blah, but, um, so, it is what it is. Sorry folks, but it is, it is what it is. Alright, so there we go. There's the next one, and there's the next one. So you will get, again, you'll get three of each of those things so let's see what's in this mercy and thing here choose your reward cool mercy and flame accessory steel neon chroma pack or the yellow f use this item to add on to your style tab this color of this is not okay so we'll do the steel neon um Sparkling, sparking aura. That kind of look, looks cool, so we'll try that. And a wild aura. What is that? Um, we'll do the blue mercy and flame. Sure. And then we'll do this. Because we'll get the steel chroma. Steel chroma. sparking aura so let's see what that sparking aura looks like before we do anything else here and you'll also notice that I am using my um, main character here just so that we can collect you know the feats if we do head uh, if we do happen to get any feats um, we'll obviously get them with our main character which is good sparking aura okay so actually being electricity that kind of makes sense so that's we're gonna Oh, no, I didn't want to do that shit. Um, hold on, damn it. <laughs> but if you guys could also do me a favor before we get too far into the video here and hit that subscribe button. As, hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Hit that notification bell as well. And hit that thumbs up button. really goes a long way in helping out the channel here as you know I am, once again, like I said, am being the guinea pig uh, for you guys. So uh, let's go back here. And now we've got some exophytes. Okay, so let's do. We got the Kryptonian, Curse Gotham, Atlantean, Shazam, Dark Knights. Uh, now I don't think, obviously, like we'll be able to get really good gear to help level ourselves up. But you could also, obviously, collect some style feats, that kind of thing here. So, so we'll see what we got. So you can do Shimmering Sunstone, which is. Uh, for every additional sunstones, okay, light emitter, collection, hands of fate, hero, oh, well look at that, it, max level is 282, so that's interesting, so you can actually get gear that's halfway decent, because like 282, that's better than what I have for the most part, so I mean, okay, so I guess I lied, you can get um, gear that will actually help you level up. So there you go. In this case, look at there. So you have the um, 
you got a piece of gear that was higher than what you got, so there you go. Nice! I like it. Again, I know a lot of people will be pissed off about that, but... Uh, Sunstone is an architecturally, architecturally programmable mineral indigenous to planet Krypton. Sunstone, blah, blah, blah. Uh, heat sink. I, I'm, honestly, I'm going to collect the gear if I can, just so that I can help level me up here. Every little bit helps. Ooh, quantum field energy. I don't actually got to take this. Heck yeah. Because that'll help level up our artifacts, so I'm not going to shy away from that. Where is that other piece of gear that I got? Oh, here it is. So this is 282. There you go. Better than what we had. Shabam. Alright, so now Cursed Gotham. Let's see what we got in here. Uh... Purple Blighted Aura. Interesting. 282 again. So we got some shoulders. Haven't gotten shoulders yet. Aha! I got a feat there. Open 5 Cursed Gotham. So there we go. Red Doomed Aura. Interesting. Okay, so we'll take the gloves because we have not done anything with that yet. don't need a belt quarks I'm gonna take the collection in this case okay take the collection shoulders shoulders are better than what we got so now we've maxed out the shoulders and I also didn't collect that style so that's good uh, drowned pirate okay so we're, we're maxed out at the hands as well. Let's collect the style. Okay. So now we would need feet, rings, legs, chest, neck, head, weapon possibly. Everything basically but the face because the face will not do us any good. All right. So let's see. Atlantean time capsules. Oh, stabilizer. We got a stabilizer piece there. Protective emblem. We don't need a belt. We're going to take the emblem. We're going to take the emblem because those sometimes can be worth feats if you collect them all. Shoulders. Don't need it. Shielding emblem. Do need it. And then. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Weapon. Weapon, weapon, weapon. Or do we want. I'm going to take the weapon actually. Okay, so we're going to take this. Hopefully that's better. It is better than what I got. So that's good. Oh, no, that's a back piece. Okay, I thought that was a weapon, but it's a back piece. Whoops. <laughs> okay, so then we'll collect this. And we'll collect this. And we're good to go there. And we're good. All right, Shazam time. Let's see what we got here. Ooh, enhanced eternal. That's 282 feet. This should probably be worth a feet, so I'm gonna take that one honestly, because that probably is worth a feet. I think. I just got that one. Shoulders we just collected. I'm gonna take that. And let's see what we got in here. Enhanced hood. Ooh, there's another emblem there, which I haven't gotten. Although that enhanced thing would be nice, but I'm going to take the emblems in this case just because there might be a feat. Oh, there was a feat. There was a 50 point feat. Aha. Okay. And there was a 10 point one there, so there you go. See? See? Uh huh. Alright, Dark Knight's time. Let's see what we got. So there you can. So there, as you can see, how you're getting the. Um, 
you have the opportunity there to gain some feats, get some skill points. Red Umbral Aura. I don't need a back piece because we just got that. I'm going to take the Aura in this case. Shoulders I don't need. Pink Ultimate Aura. We'll take the Collection in this case. And Belt I don't need. We'll take the Collection. Alright, so we're going to collect this. We're going to collect this. We're going to collect that. Okay, so we got four more here. So it, it's actually, you know, it, it's helpful in the sense of Bat Totem Emblem, Visible Ink. So it's it's helpful in the sense of, like, you can kind of go back and recollect, like, emblems that you missed in this case, collections. Um, you can go back and do... Uh, I already collected that one, so we'll do that. But, you can, like I said, you can go back and collect uh, emblems for feats. You can collect styles for feats. So there's, there's... And the fact that each one has... I already collected that one, so we'll collect this, I guess. Uh, each one has seven older time capsules and one mega capsule. So, I mean, it, again, I know a lot of people are going to be pissed off because it's, you know, they, they see it as like, oh, you're buying, um, you know, and a lot of people may spend money on this to, you know, buy the skill points and the feats and everything, but um, it's nice, though, in a way, just like, because like I said, you can go back and, like, recollect stuff that you might have missed so um, Hawk's Edge I didn't collect that there we go and then plus two which is nice too is now I have a whole bunch of gear that I can salvage and get um, exabytes for so that I can level up my stats so it's a win-win all around so far Not that I'm saying it's worth, you know, throwing a hundred dollars or something into the game, of course, but, um, you know, like I said, it is what it is, I guess, at this point. Just because, again, you know, like I said, and I've said this plenty of times, it's, you know, nature of the beast, um, unfortunately. Just the gaming, oh, I got two of the same thing, crap. Uh, it's, you know, it's just kind of the nature of the beast with the whole gaming in general let's see so that is good and this will be the same thing 282 yep okay so I can do that like that I mean the whole gaming industry in general is kind of like pay to win so unfortunately that is just like it is what it is all right, so let's see what we got here. We're getting close there, folks. I haven't collected that. What is this? Okay, I want that. Get the emblem. Collect that. That is hand, so we're going to do the collection. And one more. I haven't collected that. Collected that. That's a waste. Don't need that. We'll do the collection. Alright, so we'll collect that. We'll collect this. Collect that. And there we go. And last one. Teen Titans. This was the one that was before the Flashpoint one. Okay, so I have collected that. Feet. Did I collect feet yet? I can't remember. Do I have feet? No. Okay, so that'll probably be good. Because we'll get some feet. Some feet, some feet, some feet, some feet, some feet. Uh, I've collected that. Okay, we'll take that because I already have feet. And last one. And what have we got? 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 
Okay, so I don't need that, so we'll collect that. So even in this case here, I mean, you can kind of collect like a bunch of old collections here, which is nice. And then we got the feet, 282, which I didn't collect that, Dark Raven style, which is good. Okay, so basically I leveled everything up to 282. 282 minus my weapon, the neck piece, chest piece I didn't get, rings, trinkets 281. So, I mean, I, I got a decent amount of stuff. And there you see there, too, I also got myself uh, bumped up from 320 to 322. I also managed a skill point there, which we'll put in there. Yes, I know, I don't have that many, so shut up. I can already hear most of you guys. Oh, you only have 211 skill points. <laughs> also, don't forget, if you guys want to... Um, see me change my power with my main character see more of the main character by all means let me know in the comment section below what kind of power you want to see me play with a couple of you guys have uh, already given me some ideas um, or if you have any ideas on uh, making my electricity dps loadout better i'm also open to suggestions there too um, some of you guys have mentioned that um you know, electricity is kind of OP at the moment, so um, we'll take that as well. So now we got a whole bunch of stuff that we can. Okay. So now we have that. So that's why I said, too, you get some gear, you can salvage it, and then you can throw your stuff in here. Or you can throw it with your origin augments. So I can just kind of go bam, 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 bam. And then, so that one's 233. Uh, so they're all getting up there. So now I can go bam, and a bam, and a bam, and a bam, and a bam. And there we go. And then I can level this up. We want to do. Okay, so then I can break through that. Hooray! And so now the strategist card is one that I will need to work on getting up there. So now I've got two stabilizers. I have 17 source marks, which I need to work on as well. So really, the only pieces of gear that I have left that I need to focus on are rings, weapon, and I guess my lowest piece of gear is chest and neck piece. So there you go. So we're we're rolling here. We're up to 322. So and then obviously you need to get the solar credits for the uh, so you can get the full. 285 gear and then that'll get you up to what is the top combat rating 327 330 I mean what is it now at this point oh and I got a thing over here too I can put that in my um, so I mean is it worth it to buy these things um, I guess it depends on um, I mean they're, they're a decent value is it worth it to buy them eh, I don't know um, I mean, if you're willing to throw a little bit of money in there, maybe if you're, you know, if you, if you, um, if you're trying to throw down like a hundred bucks and you're trying to, you know, gain yourself 20 skill points and all these feats and then it's probably not worth it. Um, but I mean, overall it's a, it's a pretty decent value. I mean, if you can unlock them, I mean, you get, like I said, again, seven old time caps you go back you can collect the feats and everything so like i said i do like making these videos because i kind of like being the guinea pig uh, for you guys so that you can see yourself you know what you get when you do this kind of thing but with that being said i mean that's all i got for you guys right now so uh thank you guys so much for watching as always don't forget to like share comment and subscribe for more and until next time guys see you soon